In this video, we're going to look at comparing data sets. Now, when you're comparing data sets, do two things. Comment upon the average of the two data sets and comment upon the spread. Now, when you're doing this, relate it back to the question. So let's look at this first one. The median delay for Easy Air was 10 minutes with a semi interquartile range of 2 minutes. For Quick Jet, the median delay was 8 minutes and semi interquartile range of 5 minutes. Comment on these two data sets. So what I would always do is start with the word on average. That's why I put that in bold. So always start on, on average. So I'm comparing the two medians here. Well, the medium for Easy Jet, Easy Air was 10 minutes compared to eight minutes here. So on average, EasyJet had longer the delays than QuickJet. So I've done my comment on the average. So now I'm gonna comment on the spread. Well, we've got a semi interquartile range of two minutes for EasyAir, five minutes for QuickJet. So EasyAir has a smaller spread. So I'd say, but EasyAir's delays were less varied, they were more consistent. So my overall, my comment is on average, EasyAir had longer delays than QuickJet, but EasyAir's delays were less varied. Let's look at this second example. The mean height of pupils in class A is 175 centimetres with a range of 30 centimetres. For class B, the mean is 175 and range 47 centimetres. Comment on the height in these classes. So we've got a comment on the average. Well, the mean is 175 for A and is also 175 for B. So again, my first comment starts with on average and I've got both classes have the same height. The second thing then is I comment on the spread. So class A has a range of 30 centimetres. Well, class B has 40 centimetres. Class A's range is lower, smaller, so their heights are less varied. And that's what I'm going to put. But class A's heights are less varied. And note, I always end with varied. So, so overall, my comment is, on average, both class, classes have the same height, but class A's heights are less varied. 